Hello and good afternoon or whatever time of day you're watching this video. Today is October 1st, 3.03 p.m. It's a Saturday and today is day one of October. I've never done this before. I have, for as many years as I've had an Instagram account, I've been fascinated with this what feels like global art challenge that people take on in the month of October with varying degrees of creativity. I mean, everyone, it seems like is doing something a little bit different, but the premise of the challenge is the same. Everyone's trying to create something every day for 31 days for the month of October. And I've watched this for years and I've always wanted to do it and there's never been a great time. And even now it's not a great time. My life is very full right now, but I can't help myself, I have to do this. So, that being said, come hell or high water, I don't know what's gonna happen in the next 31 days, I might lose my sanity. I'm excited to paint some national parks because I love national parks. I created my own prompt list, so I picked 31 of the 63 national parks. Picked 31 of them, I'm gonna paint one every day, and we'll see where this journey takes me. I think I'm gonna be using all watercolor, I might decide to do gouache. I don't really know. And I don't really care. I'll just do whatever I feel like doing. And let's see what the heck happens. I have no idea. <laughs> Here we go. If for some reason I have extra time on one day and I can do two paintings when I know like the next day or whatever I'm not gonna have time, I'm just gonna do that and I don't care if that's breaking the rules. I don't. <laughs> Currently 8.14 and we're starting day six, which is Rocky Mountains. I thought it was Channel Islands today, which I was really excited about, but it's not, it's Rocky Mountains. Which unfortunately means more trees. I'm tired of painting trees. But it's okay. We're doing this, we're doing this, we're doing this, we're doing this. One thing I want to get better at with all of these um, paintings that I'm doing for October is atmospheric perspective, which is something that I struggle so, so much with. I see it in a photo or in my reference or whatever, but then it doesn't translate in what I'm painting, mostly because like I'm just using the same level of saturation and it's like things that are further away are less saturated than things that are right in front of you. And so, a great example of this is going to be the Channel Islands painting that I'm about to start, where these hills are like really dark and um, rich in color, and this is like super pale. I want so badly to get it right, but I just don't know if I'm going to. So, let's do this. <laughs>
yesterday I was four behind. And Tanner was like, what if you did four in one? And I was like, that's crazy. That's like breaking the mold of what I've been doing. And the perfectionist in me is like, every single one has to be the same size, which is ridiculous because this is a really hard challenge and it doesn't matter. Anyways, I didn't do four in one because I felt like it was too small to like try and get details in, but I did do two in one. And I really, really like the way it turned out. I feel like it's really cute. I wish I would have done this sooner. Like I wish I would have done this with some of these other ones. Cause I think it, like I just love this side by side. Today is a very big day. I'm wearing my boots for the first time uh, for the fall season. I'm so excited. Uh, but more importantly, I wanted to talk about how this whole experience of Arttober has been so interesting for me. I feel like I've learned so much and I'm growing so much, but it's also been really hard. Um, but one thing that I've noticed is that I'm just like on this roller coaster of emotions because it's like one second I'm doing really good, super high, and I'm like generating so many ideas. I'm like, I'll do this for Christmas and this for the new year and this and this and this. And then the next second I'm so low because I'm so discouraged and tired. And it's like, ugh, this isn't working. This isn't going well. I'm not doing a good job. And it's been a little bit crazy just trying to navigate the ups and downs of all of it. And I've been keeping like a little video diary of it all. Just recording my thoughts, re I'm recording the videos, like recording the whole process, trying to keep track of my thoughts and how I'm feeling and how I'm growing through all of this. And I think when it's all said and done, I'm going to make a YouTube video about it. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. It's definitely something that I've always been interested in doing, but I've always been really scared to do. Cause I just don't like being in front of people. That has never been something I've enjoyed. And so YouTube is being in front of people um, in a way that Instagram isn't. I mean, Instagram's being in front of people, but it's it's different. So I don't know. I think I'm going to do it. And I'm putting this up on Instagram to maybe keep myself accountable to actually following through and not chickening out. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs>